Hello and welcome to another wine tasting. In honour of the Tractor Tube Society, I'm wearing a t-shirt tonight, so um, let's have a look. This is the Tractor Tube Society AGM Red 2011 Shiraz from South Australia. Now there has been a lot of talk around Australia about 2011 being a bad year for Shiraz, but it really depends on the winery, the weather at the particular location, how they process the Shiraz grapes, and uh, other factors that come into play. Because of the bad year, many wineries and winemakers have worked really hard to make sure that the Shiraz comes out the best it can possibly be. So uh, lots of techniques have been put into play to get those 2011 Shirazes out in those areas that have been affected by the poor weather uh, in a way that uh, we will still enjoy. So I'm going to try this one tonight. I'm just going to let it breathe a bit. I probably should have put it in the decanter. Anyway, so I'll just read some of the back. Tractor Tube Society is a serious business which manages to keep fun on the agenda. After a long day working in our Langhorn Creek vineyard, a snap annual general meeting can be called, even on a weekend, and at mid-vintage, sometimes a few times a week, an AGM of the Tractor Tube Society is thirsty work. All hands down tools, put on togs, then roll a patched but well inflated tractor tube down to the shores of Lake Alexandria where we wallow and wait, glass in hand for the cooling breeze of the afternoon. Lake Doctor. Then, and only then, are any other matters raised. For example, whose turn it is on the barbecue. The Tractor Tube Society is an independently owned and operated vintner with a hard-working love of leisure. What we might lack for in finery, we certainly make up in flavour, combining nature, low-yielding vineyards with the best of old-school winemaking. We hope you have as much fun with our Shiraz as we did making it. Bottoms up from the full dozen at the Tractor Tube Society. Anna, Annie, Ben, Brad, Barbara, Eleanor... Fiona, Madison, the dog, Nick, Tony, times two, APB and AJP, and Za. Now, uh, that is cool. I like uh, winemakers who, have, who understand that it's, it's the love of the wine, the passion of the wine, and, the, and, um, and always be able to have a laugh about the day. And one of the things I really liked about going to the Hunter Valley meeting winemakers is they enjoy their craft and they like to make a joke about things as well. So don't take it too seriously. It's to be enjoyed. We're supposed to enjoy wine and, and have a good time with wine. Okay, 14% alcohol. And if you want to know about um, uh, Tractor Tube, this is actually produced by Zontig's Footsteps Propriety Limited, which is in McLaren Vale. So, um, oh, that's cool. I didn't actually know that until this point. Um, I have had some Zonti's Footsteps wines before, and they've been quite good, so... Okay, let's try this Shiraz. Okay. A little bit lighter than I was expecting, but that's alright. Let's have a look. Hmm, interesting. Peppery notes. Even a touch of menthol. Ah, oh, must be eucalyptus. Okay, let's try this one. A lot of acid. Not as much tannin as I was expecting, actually. Tastes quite... There's a taste I can't quite get. Medium finish. So it makes you want to drink more. I would say out of 10 for the strength of the Shiraz, 
I'd probably say around about a seven. It's quite a light. Sh it's not a really really light shiraz, but it's um, certainly not as full bodied as I was thinking it would be. Um, so I'm guessing what they've done with this one is uh, made it a light one, um, or, or maybe this is one of the effects of 2011 for Shiraz. Yeah, this is quite a lot. Shiraz, this is, um, this is quaffer material, but with a little bit more complexity. Yeah. You can't actually notice the alcohol. So that's good. Um, like I can feel the alcohol, but it's not affecting the taste so much. So they've they blended the alcohol in quite well. Um, yeah, that's actually quite nice. Okay, I will be enjoying this uh, lighter Shiraz tonight and probably tomorrow. Um, Shiraz is difficult to get through in a night unless you've got three hours spare, for me anyway. Uh, a lighter red, yeah, I could probably do. It's quite nice. It's um, not what I was expecting. <laughs> I was expecting, well, I don't know what I was expecting really. Something different. Um, yeah, I'm enjoying that. So, um, something I'll be enjoying tonight. I'll get some work done. So anyway, Tractor Tube Society, produced by the uh, by Zonti's Footsteps. And you can actually find out more at zontisfootstep.com com.au and uh, yeah check this one out okay happy drinking <laughs>